He is known for his significant contributions to the development of molecular orbital theory in chemistry. He is recognized for his groundbreaking work in computing the structure of molecules using the molecular orbital method. His name is Robert S. Mulliken. In the realm of scientific pioneers, one name stands out, Robert S. Mulliken, an American physicist and chemist whose contributions have left an indelible mark on the field. Born in Newburyport, Massachusetts, Mulliken's brilliance was evident from an early age. He dedicated his life to the development of molecular orbital theory, a groundbreaking approach to understanding the structure of molecules. Mulliken's work on molecular orbital theory revolutionized the field of chemistry. By elaborating on the molecular orbital method, he paved the way for computing the intricate structures of molecules. His groundbreaking research earned him the prestigious Nobel Prize in Chemistry in 1966, and later, the esteemed Priestley Medal in 1983. These accolades serve as a testament to the profound impact of his contributions. Mulliken's discoveries in molecular orbital theory have had far-reaching implications. They have not only deepened our understanding of the fundamental nature of matter, but also laid the foundation for countless advancements in various scientific disciplines. His work has been instrumental in areas such as chemical engineering, pharmaceuticals, and material science. Mulliken's legacy serves as a constant reminder of the immense power of scientific inquiry and the profound impact it can have on shaping our world. In his early years, Robert taught in the physics department at New York University from 1926 to 1928. It was during this time that he received recognition as a physicist, with his work being highly regarded by chemists as well. This blurred the lines between the two sciences, and both claimed him as their own. He then returned to the University of Chicago, where he became an associate professor of physics and eventually a full professor in 1931. He held a position in both the physics and chemistry departments, continuing to refine his molecular orbital theory. At that time, the primary method for calculating the electronic structure of molecules was based on the work done by Walter Heitler and Fritz London on the hydrogen molecule in 1927. This method, known as the heitler london slater pauling method, described bonds in molecules as overlapping atomic orbitals centered on the atoms involved. It was popular among chemists as it aligned with their concept of localized bonds. However, this method did not always work well when calculating excited states of molecules. Hund and Mulliken's molecular orbital method, which incorporated the concept of delocalized molecular orbitals possessing the same symmetry as the molecule, proved to be more flexible and applicable to a wide range of molecules and molecular fragments. This method, along with contributions from John Leonard Jones, surpassed the Velazbond method. Mulliken's groundbreaking work in this area led to him being awarded the Nobel Prize in Chemistry in 1966. Throughout his career, Mulliken received numerous honors and recognitions. He became a member of the National Academy of Sciences in 1936, becoming the organization's youngest member at that time. He was also elected to the American Philosophical Society in 1940 and the American Academy of Arts and Sciences in 1965. In 1967, he was named a foreign member of the Royal Society. Additionally, Mulliken's contributions to the field of chemistry are commemorated through the Mulliken population analysis, a method of assigning charges to atoms in a molecule. Do you want to explore more scientists? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.